Hey, what is up, everyone? Welcome to the channel. We're going to be doing some RTA today. The season's reset, and this season's going to be sweaty because the boy hand guy is getting a skin. If you are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe, hit the like button. We'll do some preliminary placements or whatever placements, uh, and um, have a good time, hopefully. Uh, we will be going more aggro oriented unless we're forced to go turn two. But without further ado, smack the subscribe button, and I'll see you, I guess, right now. I was going to say real soon, but <laughs> it is what it is. All right, so we get one ban and one ban only. We're getting this toxic little nuisance out of here. Uh, let me know if you guys are looking forward to this season. It looks like it's just going to be another mage season this season. If I say if I say that one more time, I'll lose it. But we'll see. We will see. Um, I do like playing more fast, but with that being picked... I will take away the Edmid though, because Edmid's a good turn two unit. As long as she's faster than the rest of the team, it should work. So we'll go ahead and just take her, because she provides so much value within the nullification, which in the, with, within the CR pushing, with the chance of uh, critical damage. She, she still provides a lot of value. What am I watching? Ruel and Vildred is hella sus. Hella sus. I don't know what this guy's doing, but it is what it is. We could double kill. We get the nullifier on anyway, so Vildred's kind of whatever. You know, let's up the ante even more and just bring. Why did I do that? Uh, let's bring. Let's bring. Um, Savior Aiden. We have a tank. We have a Soul Reaver. We have a pretty decent mage, and then we have a powerful full Soul Reaver. Uh, my last pick is going to de depend on what they go into, right? I might go Karina, uh, just to pop everything. I could go. Um, I don't know. I honestly don't know. Her demon isn't ready yet, so I can't pull her out. I'm probably going to ban the Straz. So if we ban the Straz, we're in business, I would assume. Um, Apoc's pretty good in this. Like, what world do they kill Apoc, right? I don't think they ever do kill Apoc. Um, Edward's pretty good, too. But I think what we'll do is go Kisei. Ban the Straz. Kisei's just going to help us overall do a lot more damage. If they're forced ban in a mid here, I think. Then we have zero bridges. But our Kisei is still pretty fast, so I think it should work. Especially if we can get the uh, kill on uh, Vildred. Though I think I might pressure the Rowell with Kisei and then pressure the Vildred with Giselle. Wait, what was his first unit? I'm not very comfortable with my draft. I only had one bridge. So the Hawk would have been a good option too, instead of Kisei. I kind of forced the Kisei there. And the background of this map is really cool looking. Um, can they see our push? Man. Uh, they do have attack up. We have mitigation, so... Wow, we didn't dodge. That's really freaking unlucky. Okay. The fact that we didn't dodge on just uh, a mid was just unlucky. It is what it is. And then the resistance on top of that. Um, we have a hit lower, but we have to. Damn, we got really unlucky. I should have just drafted the second cleaver um, opener. The hit lower is huge. Like, that's actually huge. And then the fact that we didn't dodge is... A mid has been really missing for me lately because she just hasn't been dodging. Like, she's... Still didn't dodge. Can I get a dodge, please? We got all these debuffs. Like... Did I say mid? I meant Aiden. Jeez. My brain is fried. Okay. Bro, da! Whatever. I'm never drafting her this season. She's trash, man. She doesn't dodge. Oh my god, that was unlucky. Alright, I gotta remember to draft two bridges. That was just not me. That was a very, very terrible draft. I'm out of the I'm out of the drafting loop. I, I haven't played RT in a minute. We'll try to fix our drafts up and try to figure this out. Um, once again, I haven't played in a minute. So I'm a little rusty. 
Uh, we get first pick, so let's just ban this. I gotta, I gotta figure out my, um, my draft style this season. I definitely want a mid in my draft style. But I think I might drop Aiden, because Aiden's just too inconsistent. Like, she didn't dodge there. Big bummer. Um, I knew that Giselle and Kise were going to die. Uh, I could have drafted the second bridge to outspeed the, uh, the, their opener. I, I could have played that a bit differently. I could have also played a bit slower and more tank down. Um, in this situation, forcing Cleave is probably not the best idea, right? And thus, they don't really speed up their pace on their units. Belion, too. Alright, so what we're gonna do here... Arwell. No, this is pretty good here, actually. Edward. We'll, we'll, we'll slow it down. Uh, Edward does work with uh, a mid, because of how his ultimate works. So if he pops the S3, he can get a second turn instantly. It's not as impactful, but it's still extra shields at the end of the day. Okay, they're taking the, uh, the Karina. I should've probably took the Karina. Shit. Um, that's a little annoying. Karina is very powerful. All right, so what do we want to do here? They're pretty slow down here. We have an opener. We could kill the Karina, most likely, if we go Giselle. We could also just execute the Bologna. Um, that's something we don't need soul burns this way. And then I think what we want to bring is probably something along the lines of a, a Landy as a bridge. Um, we have one tank, one opener. Selene is okay here if we ban out the Karina, because they should crit. So that would be pretty nice. Um, she could revive us too, depending on how fast they are. Apoc is not bad here, because they do have some beefy units. I'd rather kill fast, though. Do I, do I rely on this thing again? I don't think so. I think we go Landy. I'm, I'm probably going to have to ban the Karina. It's too strong. Or if I ban the Conk Lilies, we can deal with Karina. If we can focus her down. But that build, that's Bologna build up. Senya too, so we're banning out. Uh, the impact of this is just too much. Conk Lilies is just too much of an impact unit on our team. So we just gotta focus down the Karina real fast. Hopefully that pays off. We get Karina out of here. We start focusing down the other ones, hopefully. Like, they have, they're have, having some strong pits, uh, picks. And I haven't had any chances to bring N mid through. She's just getting banned every time. Senya doing Senya things. I am worried about a lot of this, actually. We have to just focus fire the Karina. She's too strong. Try to get it as low as possible. So Giselle can finish it off without a attack buff. And then we get pressure into Bologna. Oh, wow. That's a fake one. Do we kill it, actually? I wonder if we kill it. Yeah, we do. There's the counter. We really need to start focusing her down now. Okay, Giselle. Jeez. That's crazy. We're in a lot better situation now. Um, Senya's still annoying. So is Blind, but their damage is mainly gone, right? So we're in a lot of bit better situation. Uh, it does come down to Edward being Edward, and it does come down to Giselle wanting to cleanse herself. It's okay. We're looking really good here. Oh, we got the silence off, so the can S3. Huge. We're looking good. Don't pop the S1. That's a little unfortunate, but it is damage on the end of the day. Uh, can we strip this? Yes, we can. Um, we're going to have to just do this. We're looking a lot better here. The Karina and... I think the Karina was fake, let's be honest. That, that didn't feel like a real Karina to me. And then we win. That was a lot cleaner. That was much cleaner. So, having a secondary bridge might be the way to go. <clears throat> we'll do one more. Try to figure out our draft style for the season. Like, it might take a little bit, but we should get there. Hey, Giselle. Kind of sewer like myself. So we don't let this through. Obviously, we have first pick, thankfully. And with the first pick, we're going to take the thing that's the strongest on our account, which I think is in a mid. Uh, Nullifier. CR pushing. Just She's ridiculous. Ooh, Spectre Tenebria might be a good option here. Into Zeo, depending on what he picks. Oh, 
We'll take these two, because these two should be pretty good. And then we do need to bring an anchor. Or I should say knight. So we'll probably go with Arwell. If we picked her too soon, he could have probably DJ, DJ beat us. So that would have been pretty bad. Um, so we'll see what he does. Lots. So he's got no damage outside of Aiden right now. He really looks like he wants to lock into this Arbiter. Or, but I don't know. Out of a bad pick, in my opinion. It's going Landy. Okay, so we go with this. Uh, what else is good here? Uh, Apoc's pretty solid. In well, they have Aiden. That would try to... Actually, if we ban the Aiden, it doesn't matter. Well, what else is good here? I feel like Apoc is still good here. We ban the Aiden, and then they have no actual, like, scary damage dealer, right? They're gonna probably ban the Karina or the Amid. Could also lock in Zahawk and force to ban, but with Zeo being in the field, uh, I'm gonna take the chance. Apolitas. Uh, so, we're still gonna ban this out. Yeah, I can't... Amid will never get let through. It is what it is. Like, they're not gonna let her through. It really sucks, to be honest with you. Because I would love the player, but, like, she's so powerful that they're scared of her. Because Lua's out of the picture. The next scariest thing, in my opinion, is probably the Amid. Uh, Stenny might be a little fragile, but we do have our, um, tankier units. Resisted. That's right. Real Karina. She's getting extra effect resistance too because my Arwell is on Bastion of Hope. Uh, he upped the damage for Landy. I think what we have to do is try to stun the Politus. Oh. Barrier should keep us good. Yeah. I think we kill here. Even if we don't get to... We might have to go... Oh. Another Landy Burst? That's horrifying. Why does she get boosted up so fast? Can I have a turn? Apparently not. Uh, do we S3 and try to kill the land? Oh, she's stealth. We can't. Dude, I haven't had a turn. Okay. Um... Oh, I should just pop the S3. What the hell am I doing? We have defense buff, so we can just pop some units here. If I would have known it was going to hit, I would have popped the S3 and killed her. It's okay. I don't think we're in danger quite yet. Yeah, I don't think we're in danger quite yet. Um, Landy doesn't have her S3 up, so that's powerful. And I think Apoc's going to be okay. He's going to have to S1. I'm ripping S3 and... Um, Apocalypse Ravi, I have to. This kills, we're good. Not, I think we're still okay. Just hit, please. Yeah, we're good. We're good. That was almost bad for us. That was actually kind of like almost bad for us. But whatever. We got through it. We did it. We're we're, we're good. All right, guys. Uh, that's going to be it for this season. Or for, not this season. For this uh, video for RTA. I'm feeling a little bit more comfortable knowing that I can draft Apoc this season. Apoc's going to be really, really nice this season since she's a bit stronger. I'll just put her on a Proof of Valor and uh, draft her as like a last pick. And just have her anchor for you. Um, I'm just going to have to work out the, uh, the kinks in my drafts. But for the most part, pretty positive. I'll talk to you later. Thanks for watching. And I hope you enjoyed this one. Peace.